Within this tutorial, we're gonna go ahead and walk through the issue that you may be running into when you're installing the Unreal Engine Rue Goldberg project offline. Specifically, it has to do with the bridge plugin that you can see right here. Now, what we're gonna go ahead and do is if you see this, go ahead and just say no, we're gonna get rid of that. Now, just in case you actually press the yes button, don't worry, you're gonna just see something that looks like this. The project will still actually work, you just won't see any materials. So let's go ahead and talk about how we can get that bridge plugin and actually make it work. So up here in the top right hand corner where it says settings, we're going to go ahead and click up here and inside of plugins, we'll go ahead and click right here. And then we'll open up this window, go ahead and type in bridge up here at the top. And you can see that I have it, but it's not actually turned on. Now, what I'm going to do is go ahead and turn this on and I do have to restart the engine. Now, it'll only take a moment. Don't worry. It's pretty quick, but we do need to go ahead and get this plugin on your machine. So let's talk about what we can do to make that happen. First and foremost, you do need to have an actual computer that does have access to get this plugin. So you'll have to probably do this at home if it's not accessible at school. And when you first install the project, it will automatically go ahead and install the plugin. So let's go get that plugin. So let's go ahead and get rid of the engine here. And what you're gonna to need to do is figure out where you've actually installed the engine version that you're currently using of the Unreal Engine. In this case, we're gonna go ahead and use 5.2. So go ahead and just double click here and inside of here, we'll go into engine. Inside of engine, we need to come down here into plugins. And inside of here, we're going to go ahead and look for bridge, which we can find right here. You can go ahead and right click on this. And if you can go ahead and zip it, that'll work really well, but you don't have to, that's not necessary. You can just drag and drop it onto a thumb drive and then drag and drop it into the same exact location inside of your actual computer at school where you need this plugin so that you can use the Unreal Engine Rue Goldberg kit. For this next section, let's go ahead and assume that you don't actually have that plugin and you are at school. So go ahead and download the zip from the community dev here. And I'm going to go ahead and just double click on this. Then we'll go ahead and open this up. I'm going to take this bridge folder and I'm just going to drag it in here. And you'll notice that it is actually in that Unreal Engine engine plugins folder. And I'll go ahead and just let go. I'll go ahead and unzip this inside of here. And now you can see that we have the plugin right here. So if I go ahead and open up that project, it should now work just fine. So there you have it. Now you know how to go ahead and find the plugin that you need for this project, as well as how to go ahead and zip it up, transfer it perhaps on a thumb drive or via email and then go ahead and open it back up and then make sure that it is in the correct location so that it will work on your local computer. So if you have any other questions, comments, concerns, or confusion you need cleared up so that you can continue to create, go ahead and just leave a comment down below. We'll get back to you when we can and don't forget to be clever like and subscribe.